Softball 360 is brought to you by DeMarini. Upgrade your game with the DeMarini CL22. By Evil Sports. The best softball on the planet is evil. EvilSports.com. By Reebok. Check out the Reebok 2013 Barrage at SuncoastSports.net. And by the WSL. Play the next level. The WSL Worth North American Championship Series. Welcome back to Softball 360. I'm your host, Timmy Layton. Now it's time for the big show in the Big Apple, where you can expect to see big points and big home runs. Here's Dave Benz with the action. Showtime in the Big Apple. The rules on the Stadium Power Tour are quite simple. Each slugger gets 15 swings and each home run is worth one point, except the last pitch, which is known as the money ball, worth two points and could be the tiebreaker. Today, it's a tight battle. Only six bombers move on to the finals. Up first, Jason Baxter of Reebok. J-Bax has had a good season thus far, but is a few points shy of making the top six. But boom! The J-Back attack comes out swinging like a wild man in Gotham City. Bang, zoom, one after another, flying off his Reebok bat. It looks like J-Back saved his best for last, sending out 12 big points for the early lead and plenty of respect. Reebok's Dustin D-Rock Roberts came to the ballpark right from the hospital. While lesser men might be bedridden, D-Rock swings hard and is still able to crank out six points. Not enough for the finals, but a promise for a better season ahead. Reebok's Chris the G-Man Griner has a solid shot at the finals and is making big strides with shots like this. Deep into the yard. Good show, G-Man. Making Team Reebok proud with eight points, and the G-Man is playoff bound. Clear the deck. Time for Team Easton's softball ambassador. For Brett the Hitman Helmer, pride, passion, and power are on display as the hitman can make the finals by blasting out show bombs with his Easton bat. The hefty lefty ends up with eight points, making steady progress to the postseason. Brian, the ball will be flying Wegman steps up next. He wants the lead and goes for it, sending evil softballs back, 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 Gonzo! Weggs is working his whip-like swing, using it to his advantage, ending up with 11 points. Easton Scott Kirby is a bomber on the bubble and needs a good show tonight to stay alive for a shot at the finals. Kerbs is a solid pro, but today, the glare of the spotlight is taking the edge off his game. He's having a tough day at the plate and ends up with six points. He's still alive for the postseason, and next week's season finale in Miami is important. It's always like six or seven where it looks respectable, right? So that's where I want to be. You need seven. It's somewhere like that. Seven. Maybe a couple long ones, man. That's what we want, right? So here's the finals from New York. For the latest in the points standings, be sure to log on to softball360.com. What a crazy event in New York. Scott Kirby is really going to have to step it up if he's wanting to make the finals. So for now, be sure to check out all the standings and points information on softball360.com. That's all the time we have for tonight. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next week. But as I like to say, let's head out to the park and play ball. Next week on Softball 360, the season finale of the Stadium Power Tour from Miami. Find out which six long haul bombers advance to the finals. Uh, hey, little pressure. You know, I felt the pressure in New York, kind of choked a little bit. So, uh, 
honestly, I'm taking the approach this week, uh, not worrying about it. And highlights from week one of the Worth North American Championships from Panama City Beach, Florida. Those stories and more next week on Softball 360.